since I, since I've got back, to be honest, it's just been an awful lot of problems, and it's trying to remain positive, but it's really, really hard. Zdravím u dnešního videa, já doufám, že jste si užili začátek videa, protože to bylo naše ráno. Teď už je Adámek ve školce a já jsem vám slibovala v minulém videu, že pro vás Paul natočil nějaké záběry. Takže máte se myslím na co těšit, dostanete se do místa, kam jsme s Adámkem, když byl malinký a taky ještě s Tristanem tenkrát chodili velmi často. Bylo to takové místo, takový únik od reality a jedná se o irské rašeliniště které myslím si, že je takové unikátní a není to něco, co byste často výdali tady v Česku. Myslím si, že u nás v Česku nic takového není. Jestli se mýlím, tak mi určitě napište do komentářů. No a tady už máte dnešní vlog od Pola. Au, au. Uh, it's actually the worst part about this. It's all on these stones, right to this. It's actually grand. You're uh, very welcome. I'm not actually sure if this is recording properly or not. It's hard to tell what the, where it is. Um, let's go for a run in the bog where we used to go with Adam. Um, sneaky out a break from get some fresh air. It's a really nice place. Hope you enjoy it. I'm wearing these uh, sucky runner things. It's a little bit sore on places like this, but. Apart from that, it's actually pretty good when you get off-road onto the proper tracks. It's actually uh, a lot nicer to run. So I've come to quite a part of the bog. Uh, there's not too many people around, um, around this part anyway. Because uh, everybody else is drinking, it's a Saturday. It looks like everybody's drinking over there. I don't want to be running past them in my, in my socks and a camera. Um, I'll just stand out a little bit too much, but this uh, this ground here where I am, it's a really really nice bog. They actually cut it up and they use it for uh, they use it for for turf for for burning on the fire. But it's actually really really nice to run on the. Uh, it's actually really really nice to run on. It's like uh, it's like running on a beach. So let's go. I think it's ground like this that these uh, sucky things are made for. I actually don't know what you call them. With a jump coming up. Will I make it? Will I make it? I think... Yeah, I think we'll go around here. If it was like a... Soda Bear Grills or something like that. Yeah, I think we'll make it there. I think there's a good spot. Yeah, we'll make it there. 
Wish me luck. Ooh. Oh, did you see that? Did you see that? See how deep that is? Okay. All right. Ugh. So, yeah, uh, I don't think I'll go that way. Uh, I think I'll go, uh, to go a different way. We're not going to get a... Uh, no, we're not going to get swallowed by the bug. <laughs> that was uh, that was very deep there. <laughs> you lost the camera. Don't want that. Okay, so we we'll try this one here. Try to get across all the way back up there to the end of the bog. Let's see what happens. Ooh. Ooh. So I'm uh, happy enough, I made it across there, just about, um, I'm not sure here. There is, there's my, there's my trail destruction going all the way down into there. Okay, uh, anyway, let's keep going. It's like run across, it's kind of, it's like a desert, like, uh, I don't know, Death Valley or something like that, the way it is. The ground is all kind of, I don't know, it's cool though. Absolutely massive bog. So flat. I don't know, maybe there used to be a sea here at one point or a massive lake or something, I don't know. But um, anyway, I think I will go that way. Let's go. These are cool, I just thought I'd show you these. These are really, really big uh, kind of peat briquettes. Um, it's like a massive blocks. Actually, burn them. But it's cool. It looks like something that they used to build with, uh, with the pyramids were or something like that, you know. Um, really cool place. Anyway, I keep running. It's uh, it's been a while since I've been running. I haven't been doing as much running. I've been trying, but uh, mainly cycling because my legs are kind of in bits. But uh, it's a really good, really good opportunity to go running places like this, yeah. It's really, really nice. Okay, I'm going up to uh, decision point here. I think I'm going behind the forest here, yeah. Let's go. Okay, so coming into here, I think it's uh, some type of vehicle yard that they use for all the cool machines to cut the bog. So I think it's pretty cool. That. So what that's for. Oh cool. It's like a conveyor belt. It's like a up there it's like a conveyor belt. It's where they put all the uh obviously gets all the bricks and puts them onto the back of a trailer. One of these things here. I don't love this. Uh, that's cool. Here we are. Oh, he would love this. I'm liking this too. Massive double wheel tractor. Two of them actually there's those two there. Jay, look at that. That is a beast. Yeah, it's pretty cool. What do you have over here now? There's more tractors. Oh, cool. That's on a uh, caterpillar tracks. Everything's on tracks or double wheels. It's pretty cool. Wow. And this thing over here, see what this is. Adam, you would absolutely love this. <laughs> this is something like from the moon. Yeah, beast. It's like a big massive moon dump truck or something like that. Look at that. It's pretty cool. Anyway, it's quite a lot of pace here. Keep running. This is uh, it's actually a really nice soft ground to run on. I can't actually see if this is uh, this is recording too well or not because the, the screen is on the other side. But I actually remember running through here with Tristan. And uh, yeah, when the weather turned bad. We got really, really bad. When it's a nice day like today, yeah, it's pretty cool. Look at this. Just stuffed 
just goes on for miles. I'm not sure you can make out the distance there. I'll try and focus in a little bit further. But, uh, yeah, it just goes on for miles. And ditch more. And probably another ditch here, is there? Yeah, another big ditch here. Yeah. It's pretty cool. Yeah, so I'll do some stretches. Hope you're liking it. Um, the leg is telling me to take a break, so I still have that pain thing again. So I have to come back a lot more today. Oh, so that pain going up here. Uh, some people are telling me it's a trap nerve here. Other people tell me it's got to do back trap nerve or something like that. But yeah. look, I'll just need to. I'll probably just need to warm up. I didn't warm up at all because what I was doing was I was just working in the apartment. Um, I was actually doing some toiling, grouting, stuff like that. Um, discovered a new leak, another problem. Since I've, since I've got back, to be honest, it's just been an awful lot of problems and it's trying to remain positive, but it's really, really hard. But um, look, it is what it is. I'm happy that Adam and Kat are in the best place at the moment, the best weather. Because what you see here, it's pretty much a summer, you know. But, uh, ah. Ooh. Ooh, I felt that. Ooh. Ah. Anyway. I have to do something about this. I have to get this sort of just here. That's like a trap nerve or a cramp or something. It's going right in. It's like I'm getting a needle. But it's not as bad as what it was. Which is good. I'll take that. Little fig trees. You know? Same as the apartment. <laughs> it's not as bad as what it was when I first opened the door. So it's getting better. And we're getting there. Which is cool. Um, or hopefully, get this place rented out. And... Uh, Adam and Cat will follow, follow over and uh, we get to have a bit more of a family occasion for the short while that they're going to be here for. So hopefully things work out like that. But uh, yeah. This side or this side? I think I'll go this side because it's cooler. It's more risk of falling in. So I'll come from up here. All the way up to the end here, but uh, I'm not going to risk jumping across this again because this one looks uh, a few like I'm not sure if you can tell the height of this. This is actually where that mark is up there. That is probably my height, and then another probably foot and a half up there. You can't really tell. So I think I'll go down this way. Let's go. where that area is where they have all the cool vehicles so I'm heading back over that way and uh, yeah really, really nice let's keep going so I'm back now just where I crossed, uh, I actually just fell over, that's where I got kind of sucked into the ditch over there. So I'm just back here now, uh, where I first crossed over to go up into, into the little forest there. Um, here, this is where I'm going to end it. Uh, the reason why i done this is because I want Adam, especially Adam, to see that I'm, I'm trying to keep myself active. And to let him know that even though I'm not there, I still want to be some type of role model for him. So that like when he's looking back over these videos or when he sees these things, he can see his dad actually trying to keep himself in, in some form of shape and trying to improve things. So I think that's it's a part for him to see that even though I'm not there, uh, I, I'm still doing. I'm still trying to keep myself in shape, and hopefully he'll he'll do the same as as he gets older. Anyway, that's it. I'm gonna. I might uh, I might bring bring the camera across with me. Uh, I will bring the camera across with me, but I might keep it running. <sighs> Winds begin to pick up. Let's go. Quick. Uh. Anyway, that's me. Um, a holy for checking. Bye bye. <laughs>
No a dostali jsme se na konec dnešního videa. Já musím říct, že jsem se strašně ráda podívala zase na místo, kam jsme fakt chodili velmi často, protože to byl takový náš únik. Tam ten bok, to rašeliniště a vlastně jsme se tam i několikrát koupali. To bylo takové jediné místo pro nás, protože moře vlastně od toho městečka, kde v Irsku bydlíme, tak je půl hodiny, nebo jakoby hodinu asi spíše, no, spíše hodinu. A ono nejde jezdit každý den a hlavně to počasí tam tomu moc neodpovídá, abyste se koupali v moři. Takže když se náhodou udělalo fakt teploučko, tak jsme využívali toho, že jsme šli právě k tady tomu jezírku, které je součástí tady toho rašeliniště. Pol tam sice nebyl, ale vy, kteří nás sledujete dlouho, tak určitě víte, protože já jsem tam taky docela často natáčela. No takže mějte se moc hezky, pokud se na nás díváte v pátek, tak si užijte víkend. Vypadá to, že bude nádherně, že bude horko a já si se myslím, že Adámek až přijde za chvilku ze školky, tak skočí hnedka do bazénu. <laughs> tak mějte se krásně a ahoj. Thank you.